how to create animated electric text in DaVinci Resolve 17.4.6. Inside your project's edit window, go to Effects, and underneath Toolbox, select Effects, and go to find Fusion Composition. Click and drag one of these effect filters to your edit timeline. Select your Fusion Composition clip, holding Ctrl and press D. Use Command instead of Ctrl if you are a Mac user and alter the duration of your clip depending on how long you wish for your electric text animation to last for. Here in this example I will set the clip duration to 10 seconds. Click on change when you're done. Right click on your Fusion Composition clip and go to open in Fusion page. Inside your nodes panel hold and shift and press space. Use the search box at the bottom of the select tool window to find the text plus tool. Select this and go to click on Add. Click on the grey box to the right of Text 1 and drag your mouse cursor to the yellow arrow alongside Media Out 1 to make a connection. Select either the left or right view buttons to preview your clip above your Fusion timeline. Adjust the viewer option if necessary. With your text node selected, go to Inspector and underneath the text type in the message that you wish to have displayed on screen during your electric animation. For the font style, try and find a format which resembles text that you see on a computer screen. Here in this example, I will select OCR A Extended. Make the appropriate adjustment to the size variable. Double click on the color box. And in the HTML box, add in the following hexadecimal code, hashtag 0051FF, to add a light blue shade to your text, which will also be similar to the color shade that we add to our spark effects later on in this tutorial. Click OK, go to Shading, underneath Properties, select Text Outline alongside Appearance. Reduce the thickness of the text outline to 0.015. Back inside your Nodes panel, deselect your text node by clicking anywhere on the Nodes grid, hold and shift and press space again, and go to add the Fast Noise node. Connect this particular node from the Output box to the blue triangle alongside text 1 to apply a light and dark cloud pattern to your text. With this fast noise node selected, return to inspector and underneath noise, increase contrast to 2, set brightness to 0.5, which should both add a glowing effect to your text. Although we have increased the brightness and contrast, there is very little brightness variation across each of our letters. In order to increase this, to generate the illusion that there is electricity flowing through each of these letters, increase the scale value. The value that you apply here will depend on the amount of text that you have on screen. Here in this case I will set this to 20 and now we can see more of a mixture of light and dark patterns on each of our letters. In order to animate this varied shaded appearance and at a fast rate which reflects electricity flow, increase C3 to 1. Select your text node Hold and shift and press space, and go to add a blur tool. Underneath inspector for this node, increase the blur size to 3 to add a gentle fuzzy appearance to your text, similar to that of faint neon lights. With blur 1 still selected, hold and shift and press space once more, and go to add a glow tool. Increase glow size to 21, and reduce the vibrancy of your glow Decrease the glow slightly to 0.7. Decrease blend to 0.14. Now to apply the electrical spark effect to our characters. Return to your edit window. Back inside the effects menu, select generators. And underneath fusion generators, find noise gradient. Select one of these and drag this to your edits timeline directly above your fusion composition clip. Ensure that the duration of this new clip matches that of your Fusion Composition clip. Select the Noise Gradient Edit. Go to Inspector, click on the Settings box next to Generator. Underneath Composite, set Composite Mode to Color Dodge. And underneath Generator and Version 1, select Gradient. On the Gradient bar, select the node which appears at the end underneath the white section at position 1.0. Double click on the color box and apply the following code hashtag 00E8FF. Click OK. 
change the position of this node from 1.0 to 0.5. Now drag your mouse cursor to your gradient bar towards the far right side so that an addition symbol appears to the bottom right corner of your mouse cursor. Click once to add a new gradient node. Ensure that the position of this is set to 1.0 and change the color to black. Select controls to sharpen the spark effect on your animation, increase detail to 10 and increase contrast to 2. Like with the previous fast noise node in our fusion composition clip, the value for scale will depend on the size of your text. Here in this example, I will increase the scale to 2.3 and ensure that the seeth rate is set to at least 0.1 to add a gentle animation effect to the sparks. The background music in this video is provided by the Proud Channel Sponsor Audio, a link to the company's website and another one which will enable you to make a discounted purchase of a lifetime supply of music and sound effects can be found in this video's description box. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video, take care.